played, played very good today, a uh, solid match. Uh, John and I exchanged quite a few pairs to start with and uh, a couple of birdies round the turn. I, I was fortunate enough to eagle the 11th. We half birdies on 12 and 13 and uh, I was fortunate enough to win uh, 14 with a par and then it was just a case of trying not to do anything silly and forced John to, to have a go and I was fortunate enough to, to hold on and uh, win the match on 17 so I'm delighted, looking forward to the quarters now so it's great, you know, it's been really good fun so. I uh, got out of jail on 18 with, with a lucky break and then hit a good tee shot up 19 and hit it close and birdied it the exact same putt this morning and rolled it in as well so it was nice to know the line No, I played really well, both played, I feel sorry for Ross because he played very well the whole way around no, it, just, it was a great game. Ross played very well. It's, we can't praise him enough for his game. Like, it was really well for that game. Well, so far the weather has been very good. The course is absolutely excellent and uh, it's a uh, credit to the way it's uh, been uh, souped up for this competition and also for the Open, which is to happen in two years' time. Yeah. So it's a credit to Ride Port Rush. The, the two new holes are absolutely excellent. Uh, I was looking there at the drive uh, of one of the individuals playing this morning, and he, mu he must have been halfway. He was about 20 or 30 yards over the new uh, big bunker on the right. This this has probably been the the first real uh, test for the new Dunluce Lynx layout. Uh, we now have effectively 300 uh, Category 1 scratch players uh, all uh, playing the two new holes on Dunluce in particular uh, are being carefully observed. So the, the feedback so far has been most encouraging. Yeah, I mean, I've spoken to quite a few of the players this week. Um, indeed, a number of the players uh, would have even this two-year ambition to be part of the Open Championship in 2019. So this uh, is really a part of history this year. Um, we've had a lot of history with the north of Ireland uh, since its origin and new holes coming into the Valley Links. Uh, back even around the early 1950s. So it is one of the great amateur championships that has seen a huge amount of change over the past 60, 70 years. Uh, great changes here on both the Valley and Dunluce, but uh, th this is particularly special now uh, because these players will be the first to say that they've played under championship conditions indeed played the Open Championship course uh, at Royal Portrush 